Hello my dear student, how are you? Hope you are well at home. My dear beloved student, you know, we are learning about the organs of Bangladesh government. It's chapter 7, Bangladesh Government Studies of class 9 and 10. Last class, you, you, uh, we learned about the central administration. My dear student, today, uh, we are going to learn about the composition and the function of the local administration and we also learn the local administration, the district administration, the divisional administration, also learn the function of the deputy commissioner and we also learn about the Upujala administration. My dear student, hope you will enjoy the class. Today's class. Welcome to all of you to Bangladesh and Global Studies class of class 9 and 10. My dear, this session is presented by MD Aminur Rahman, Senior Teacher, Milestone College Sector 4 branch. My dear student, last class we have discussed about the Central Administration. Hope you have studied a lot on that topics. And now let me check you how did you do, how get you from the previous class. Okay, my dear student, <clears throat> there is some question for you. Number one, what is must for the internal peace and the development of any state. Can you tell? Okay, let's see. Yes, sir. For smooth administrative, a smooth administrative system is must for the internal peace and development of a state. The next one is, who is the head of the ministry? Can you tell who is the head of the ministry? Yes. Minister is the head of the ministry. The next question for you. Who is the main administrative officer of ministry? Main administrative officer. Yes, the answer is secretary. The next question for you, my dear student. Bangladesh secretariat is based on which system? The answer is bureaucratic system. Last question for you. What is called secretariat? Yes. Different ministers and their divisional office are collectively called secretariat. Okay. Thank you. Uh, my dear, now let us know our today's topics. Our today's topic is Composition and the function of the local administration in Bangladesh. The local administration, divisional administration, then the district administration, function of the deputy commissioner, and we also know about the Upuzela administration. My dear, first of all, we will discuss about the composition and the function of the local administration in Bangladesh. My dear beloved student, you know, in for every state for maintaining smooth administration, for keeping the peace and harmony in the society, is required the local administration. But this local administration is not same. Every country has the local from a government, but the local administration, local administrative system are not same. Look, there's some reason for the difference. Variation in the people, uh, then the history, tradition, experience, sequence of the transformation, then the production system, political culture, based on the above mentioned reason the 
form of the local administration is variety my dear look the next we will learn <coughs> about the local administration my dear student the main objective of the local administration is to maintain the law and order collect revenue and implement the decision of the government <coughs> my dear the local administration means a form of administration at local level suppose that uh, the division, division district upazila and it's formed for the sake of convenient governance my dear you know uh, we will discuss later today's class the chief of the division divisional commissioner chief of the uh, district deputy commissioner chief of the upazila upazila nirvahi officer they are maintain the administration locally they are maintain the local administration is considered my dear the local administration is considered as the agent or the representative of the government okay now the divisional administration look this is the map of bangladesh and it is a divided into three into eight parts that means in our country there it has eight division dhaka chitogong rajshahi khulna borishal silet rangpur and mymansingh these eight are the divisions of our country my dear student you know for each division there is a divisional commissioner a this divisional administration is a second level administration and the divisional commissioner is tops of the divisional administration divisional commissioner enjoy the equivalent rank of joint secretary divisional commissioner is one of the principal officer of bangladesh civil service is most important officer uh, and uh, of bangladesh civil service he serves like a bridge my dear student you know as a bridge like a bridge he serves like a bridge to establish the connection between the divisional and the district administration and he serves also as a agent of the bangladesh or as a government um, in indeed if it is required he serves as a agent of bangladesh government now my dear student look uh, the district administration it is a third level administrative system of bangladesh bangladesh it, there is a 64 district you know each and every district there is a deputy commissioner he is the chief of the relevant district this de deputy commissioner enjoy the equivalent rank of deputy secretary deputy commissioner conduct the district administration my dear student the deputy commissioner has accountable for his action to the divisional commissioner whereas the divisional commissioner is the head countable accountable for all action to the central administration my dear look the deputy commissioner is accountable to divisional commissioner and divisional commissioner is also accountable to central administration okay my dear student now let's know about the function of deputy commissioner who is the deputy commissioner yes deputy commissioner is the chief of district chief of district okay now uh, you know uh, the deputy commissioner exercise a comprehensive function a lot of function he have to do among all of them 
prominent some prominent function some important fun function we will discuss to our today's class my dear student first of all deputy commissioner um, uh, the main function of him relating to the governance he implement all the decision and all the decision my dear relating to the governance which are uh, accepted by the bangladesh secretariat all the decision order uh, all the decisions and order that had been uh, decided or had been uh, the decision had been taken by the central government who has impl implemented the deputy commissioner Im deputy commissioner apply, apply it my dear the next one is the function relating to the revenue look my dear student the deputy commissioner being the chief collector deputy commissioner is the chief collector of the district that means he collect all the revenues in additional duty deputy commissioner also helps in the teachers many function my dear student look to the next one third one function relating to the coordination the role of deputy commissioner toward coordination affairs is not less important the main inter official communication among all the government officers existing in the territory of the relevant district he for making the development in the district also keeps the close connection with the important and the and the uh, responsible individual uh, uh, in order to solve the different problems of the locality my dear student look the next one is function relating to the local governance deputy commissioner plays a very vital role towards the local governance affairs he is the superintendent of the local organizations he appears all the uh, um, he appears as a role of caretaker in respect of all the upazila and union council within the jurisdiction even jurisdiction uh, even uh, he plays that role my dear the next one is function relating to the humanity deputy commissioner or dc plays his role in different humanian in different humanism function to you he virtually control all the business from market of the district during any natural calamities or any needs if it's required for any um, for mine any natural calamities uh, he come forward to help the people to solve the problem the next one is activity about the education and culture he maintains law and order to establish the peace and frequently with the help of the district police super my dear and all the education and the cultural organization all the educational activity and cultural activity all the educational institution um he is the he this deputy commissioner monitors it my dear student uh, look to the next one is function relating to the disciplinary measures he maintain law and order to establish the peace and uh, to establish the peace and harmony with the help and uh, also in that case also deputy commissioner helps uh, take the help from the police super to uh, maintain the peace and harmony he, my, my dear in that in uh, this issue deputy commissioner also uh, sometimes he may do the, uh, the mutual disputes uh, he may uh, for he may do the penalty of the big uh, criminals or uh, physically or the or economically penalty he may give the next one is my dear the some other functions deputy commissioner being the principal officer 
uh, of the and the chief of responsible responsible person of the relevant district is the chief controller of the district um, uh, he stands by the people who sustain loss duty to the different natural disasters like uh, he all help help the people uh, who has lost their houses or records food and medicine uh, or in many way he helped the deputy commissioner details preventive measures as the district magistrate he looks after the law and order and the situation and the coordinate the everything so deputy commissioner by name he may called the director of the district superintendent of the district and the controller of the district my dear student that's all about the function of deputy commissioner now the last topics of today's class upazila administration my dear student in our country upazila is considered as the most important administrative system each district each and every district divided some several upazila that means this is sub district sub district every administrative thana or police station is itself a upazila at present we have 490 upazila in our county and each in upazila there is a monitors or a bangladesh um, government for administrative for smooth administration he is called uno upazila nirbahi officer upazila nirbahi office nirbahi officer is the chief of upazila administration my dear student the function including all kinds of development and administration of upazila as um, uh, round around the upazila uno my dear student that's all about the upazila administration now this is the time for taking homework i i think you understand about the function and a uh, function of the deputy commissioner your homework you will explain the function of deputy commissioner and uh, you will write down it and the picture of your answer script you will send it to the your respective subject teachers my dear student thanks to all of you stay home stay fine